Hi, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna upgrade Acer Aspire E5471 RAM and SSD upgrade. And we also we're going to replace the laptop battery. First, we will flip the laptop. We will remove the old laptop battery. Now we will start removing all the back cover screw one by one. As you can see in the video here. Keep the, all the screw in one place. And no need to worry, all the screw length are same for this laptop. So it's okay to mix up. As we can see here, this laptop has never been opened before. As we can, you all can see, just now there was a Acer sticker there. Once we already remove all the screws, Remove the memory card slot, make sure, and then we remove the DVD bay tray. Now use a playing tool to separate the back cover from the laptop. Gently lift the back cover and disconnect the speaker cable from the motherboard. This can be done by using hand grenade, actually you don't need a special tool. We need to pull out the cable from the connecting. Now we can remove the back cover. As we can see now, there is two RAM slot, so we will first remove the old RAM and use contact cleaner to clean the RAM slots. And we also will clean the RAM also, the original RAM. The original RAM came with this laptop was 2GB, so today we will upgrade it to 6GB. Now gently pull out the hard disk. Here is our new SSD which we're going to upgrade. It is a 240GB Western Digital SSD. This laptop only can use SATA SSD. So now we need to transfer the uh, hard disk bracket to the new SSD. It's very easy. There is four screw on the to open. Do it one by one. Open one bracket and transfer it. 
the secure in the closed loops. This old hard disk we actually we can use it as an extra hard disk. You need to buy the extra hard disk casing. You can use it to store uh, media files, big files like media, music, or movies. Now place the new SSD aligned with the SATA connector and gently push to secure it. Install the old RAM back to the RAM slot and the new RAM to the new and the second RAM slot. The RAM we're using for this upgrade is the Rochelle 4 GB PDR3 L model. Reconnect the speaker cable back to the motherboard first before securing, uh, inserting the, all the screw and securing the back cover. It may fire, it may be some challenging, but actually it can be done without any using any tool actually. Gently press the back cover against the lab door and secure it with all the screws. Don't over tighten the screws. Reinsert the DVD bay tray and lock it with screw. Only one screw will be holding the DVD bay. Now if we install the new laptop battery, make sure before you installing the battery, check the tally the physical with the old original battery.
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe our my channel. Thank you.